Adding iTunes products is very easy. You first of all need to be a member of the iTunes affiliate program. I've included a link underneath this video where you can apply to join the program. And then when you get accepted, you will get an affiliate ID. So once you get that ID, you just need to paste it into here and you're ready to start adding products from iTunes and getting paid as an affiliate. So first of all, you'll see a few things here. You'll see up here, this is where you can change the icon. If you remember what the icon is, that's this here. You can click on add category and that's this here part here. And then you can have collection name, collection subtitle. So you can see the collection name is up here and the subtitle is here. And then you'll see iTunes collection background. You can have a cover image or you can just choose a background color. So you can either just choose to have a color here or you can have an image here in this here area right here. So as you can see, I've got a category added already, but I will go ahead and add another category. So I can choose my category title. So you can see here, classical music. For this example, I'll do rock music. Description. And then I can search and you can see, I can select whatever country my app is mainly targeting. Type in my search. You can see here music, you can do podcasts, movies, music videos, audiobooks, TV shows, softwares, and ebook. And I'll click on search. And then you can see here the choices come back, which I can just select. If I want to, I can edit the titles and the descriptions just by clicking here. And when I'm happy with my selection, I just scroll down and click on save. If I want to see more results, I can just click on show more results. And then I'll click on update and preview so my changes are reflected. And I can also add thumbnail images if I wish. Click on edit, you will see change or choose. If you click on it, it'll show you thumbnails that you can add. You can upload your own by clicking on add more. And then I'll update and preview my app and I'll be able to see the changes. iTunes and then you can see there's the thumbnail that I've added here are the item listings and the price there's a description you can put it in sometimes listings don't have descriptions so I always recommend you go and add your own and if people click buy now it'll take them through to the iTunes store so the iTunes feature can be a great addition to your apps for example, you can see you can add podcasts. Maybe you have a movie review app. So you can add movies. You could have certain apps promoting certain types of music where you can add that music into the app. Same with TV shows, as many ebooks. I mean, podcasts are very popular on the iTunes store. And it can be a way for you to get the most popular podcasts within a popular niche and place them onto the app and people will remember where they got that value from so if they find a podcast from your app that they like or they see content on your app that they like then they'll remember that so whether you're a niche marketer or you're a business owner who uses podcasts as part of their marketing or uses maybe they have audiobooks or ebooks in the itunes store well then you can list those products within your app.